Akyat ulit kami sa taas. Good morning, good morning. And dito kami sa Migido o Armagidun in biblical time kaya i-explore namin ang Migido ang ganda ng entrance ang daming roses napakaganda guys iyan ang aming mga kasama na trippers very nice entrance here full of roses pupunta kami sa Megiddo o Armageddon in biblical times kung saan nagbattle ang mga bad and goods noon kapanahonan ni Jesus kung siya ay dumating sa lupa iyan guys ang dami daming flowers ang dami daming flowers dito yan ang aking mga kasamang trippers I-explore natin ang Megiddo o Armageddon in times of Jesus. Tell Megiddo National Park Heritage. Ayan. Ganda ng bukid. Sakay na. Ang ganda dito, green na green. Day! Akin na yung malo. I bring malo. Kasi baka malamig sa ibabaw ng bukid. Ay, ay, ay. Welcome to Megiddo, the biblical and archaeological story of Megiddo, one of the strongest city in the land of Israel. One city whose remains are considered the most important archaeological tell in the land of Israel, and the one of the most important in the entire ancient Near East. That city is Megiddo. And the question is why. To understand Megiddo is importance, then we can see the extraordinary strategic significance of the place. Megiddo controlled the main international road that connected Egypt in the south to Mesopotamia and Anatolia in the northeast. Those the world's largest hubs, therefore, Megiddo was situated on the ancient world's most important road. Anyone who wanted to travel from the land of Nile to Assyria, Babylonia, or the Hittite kingdom had to go through here. On the Via Maris, one can see here in this valley. The First World War took place, truly the first 3,500 years ago. On one side, Pharaoh, Thutmose the third king of Egypt. On the other side, a coalition of Canaanite kings, backed by the kingdom of Mitanni from Mesopotamia. But the interesting story is just the valley. It's actually the tell overlooking at Telephone Megiddo. Megiddo was associated with important figures in the ancient world. King Solomon and King Josiah of the Kingdom of Judah, Ahab King of Israel. The Pharaoh ruled Egypt, Thutmose III, Shishak and Nico Tiglath Pileser, and Sargon King of Assyria. It's no wonder that this tell has attracted archaeologists since the beginning of the 20th century. The German Society for Oriental Research. What's so interesting at Megiddo of all places? <laughs> Wokaton talaga, wokaton. Ito 
kami sa Megido till Megido till Armageddon kung saan kung saan ang battlefield ng good and the bad nung unang panahon ni Jesus kami ay magwawakaton hanggang doon sa kabilang gilid may itong dala kong malong <laughs> pang protection sa init <laughs> An archaeological tell is a site where settlement were built one on the other. One on top of the other was built and destroyed, another was built and destroyed and each time a settlement was built a layer was actually formed. And the case of Megiddo, in the section that was dug down to bedrock. We can in fact see remains from 30 cities that were built on top of each other. For some 3000 years. So Megiddo has 30 historical layers, one atop the other. From the Neolithic period, when humans started growing their food instead of hunting and gathering it. Through the Bronze Age. The Canaanites, Israelites, Assyrians, the entire history of this land is folded into accumulated 20 meters of archaeological layer cake. Today, researchers use DNA studies and advanced dating methods to continue discovering Megiddo's secrets. The archaeological findings are indicative of powerful and wealthy city. Monumental gates, luxurious palaces, gigantic temples, stables and hundreds of horses and an impressive water system. In the book of Revelation in the New Testament, describes the battle of the end of days, a detailed description of the war of judgment day. The decisive battle between the army of God and the forces of evil, the apocalypse, where will it take place? In a place called Armageddon, a Greek distortion of the world Mount Megiddo. Now, Megiddo is known for its historical, geographical and theological importance, especially under its Greek name Armageddon. This is the story of Megiddon. Ang daming bato. Napakalaking history dito about battle of the final coming of God. The maraming namatay dito at dahil sa war nung unang panahon. mga antik yung mga haligi dito mga antik yung mga haligi Step by step, going down to the tunnel. Joke lang ah. Revi. Pupunta na kami sa tunnel sa baba. Nang migido till our magidon. Sekendi, sekendi. Woi, tengok mu yang di nadaanan mu. Hehehe. <laughs> Parang gano'n siya na nung sa Pinas. Yeah. Yeah, nasa tunnel na kami. We're going in sa tunnel.
Exciting ito ang aming trip dahil binisita namin ang hideout ng mga mga sinaunang tao noon kung saan sila ay nagtatago sa kapanangunan ng gera. Iyan ang tanil. Very excited. Interesting. Hawak-hawak lang. Candy! <laughs> Ito ay taguan ng mga sundalo noong unang panahon noong gira ng good and the bad No in time of Jesus. Mami ng bundok, my God! <laughs> my God! May lalim kami ng bundok! Masa ilalim na ko kami. Look at the stone here! Ng tunnel. Oh. Kita nyo guys, nasa ilalim kami ng tanil. Nasa ilalim kami ng bundok. My God! <laughs> Ang ganda. This is my first time here. Very, very interesting. Oh, dito na kami sa... Akyat ulit kami sa taas. Oh my gosh, ang ganda dito guys. Kita na mo kami. Mas malapit na kami sa exit kaya oh, ang exit. Nauna na yung iba kaya hindi maingay. Ang <laughs> ganda ng kita ng tanin. Oo, oh, ang ganda. Ang ganda tignan. Ito exit na. Maksilan mo. Wala. Nag-iisip ko yung mga. Ha? Ang ganda. Ang ganda. Huh! Andito na kami. Pinawisan na ako akit baba. Ayan. Ang bus namin naging tagdam. Diyos ko. Nihingal ako. May eksilang po ha. Hindi ka nang mataas. Nihingal. Taas na ngagdan ni Akyat namin ah. Ay, exercise na naman. Ayan si Candy. Hinihintay ako sa taas. Wow guys, this is interesting. First time ko dito. Ah, this is the tunnel of Armageddon. Thank you guys for watching. Bye-bye.